If you want to learn how to get the best possible horse in Red Dead Redemption 2, which is the White Arabian for free, stay tuned because I'm about to show you how to do it. Hey, hey, YouTube! This is Gamer Corey, and today I'm going to show you how to achieve this beautiful, majestic horse, the White Arabian in Red Dead Redemption 2. So if you guys want to learn how to do that, let's get started. First things first, we have to pull out our map and mark the Lake Isabella area. As you can see, I've indicated our waypoint exactly where we need to find this free White Arabian horse. Now that we have reached the Lake Isabella area, we can start our search for the White Arabian horse. We haven't quite reached our waypoint that we had marked on the map previously, but upon my surprise, when we get to the top of this little ridge right here, the first time in this area, I see a white Arabian horse right there for the taking. Now keep in mind that this is the first time that I came into this area, and this is the first time that I tried to tame a wild horse. Don't do what I did here and I tried to continuously call out for it. I tried to chase after it. Don't do that because I'm actually going to show you how to do it the proper way. This being my first initial attempt to calm the white Arabian horse, I was actually able to get really close to it. I was able to start patting it and starting to calm it down a little bit better. And I'm like, okay, I don't know if I should quite mount this horse yet. And then I got kicked in the face by the horse. Keep in mind that the first time that you come into the Lake Isabella area, you might have to do some searching to find the White Arabian Horse, and if you're not able to find it right away, you might have to come back at a later time. In these next couple of scenes, I wanted to show you that I was not able to successfully tame this horse. I was having an issue with holding the love trigger and calling me at the same time. So if you are struggling with not being able to tame this horse right away, it's okay, I failed as well also. And don't let the local wildlife intimidate you too much. If they knock you over, just get up and try again. This happened to me a few t different times as well while I was trying to tame this uh, white Arabian horse. Now let's go ahead and start the taming of our white Arabian horse. The first thing that you're gonna need to do is find it and then holding the LT button, you'll have to call out to the horse. Now keep in mind that I am on an Xbox One. If you are on a PS4, you'll have to figure out the appropriate buttons for yourself. Each time you wanna hold the left trigger button and slowly approach the horse. As it is spooked, you wanna calm down and you wanna stop your character. When you, the appropriate time is right, you can slowly start moving towards the horse again. And as soon as it is spooked a little bit more, then calm it and stop and calm it. If it does it a couple times in a row. As we get a little bit closer to this horse, you're going to be able to pat it. Then in this specific incident, it wasn't letting me pat right away. But you're going to want to pat it as soon as you possibly can. The animation does take a little bit of time, so don't mind that. Now, during this next process, I padded a couple different times. I don't know if it really helps out or not. But then, when you are ready, go ahead and mount your horse. Now, this next tricky part is holding the left trigger button and kind of slowly moving it in the opposite direction while clicking the calm button at the same time. So you're kind of doing a few different things at once kind of doing it in the opposite direction that the horse is moving. It does take a long time to tame the White Arabian because it is one of the most beneficial horses in the game. So you will be doing it for a while. Once you have successfully broken the horse, it will give you the alert that you are able to do that. And now what we need to do is go find the other horse that we brought into the area, remove the saddle and put it on this horse. Now that you have brought the white Arabian horse back to the other horse that you brought into the region, make sure that both of your horses are hitched so that you can remove the saddle from your previous horse. You're going to want to hold down on the left trigger button and remove the saddle, giving you a nice little cutscene. Now you're going to bring it over to the newly claimed, tamed white Arabian horse, and then you can saddle that one up, giving you another short little cutscene as well. And the next scene that you're going to get is a horse bonding achieved. 
Now, being a cowboy, you want to know how much your horse is now worth after bonding with it a little bit. If you only do a level one bonding, it is worth $48 and goes up after each bonding experience. At level one, it is worth $96. At level two, it is worth $144. At level three, it is worth $240. And at level four bonding, it is worth $360. Now, keep in mind, this is the sell price at a horse fence stolen store. Now, if you would like to sell the white Arabian horse right after bonding with it at a normal stable and not the horse fence stables, uh, at level zero, so just after you bond with it, it is worth $24. At level one, $48. Level two, $120. 180 at level three and at level four bonding it is worth 240 dollars now there is only one other better horse in the entire game known as the rose gray bay arabian horse now the only way that you can get this horse is by completing the epilogue one which is in blackwater so that is just along the storylines but it is also valued at 1200 dollars that's a lot of cash if you want to buy the best horse in the game. So by getting the White Arabian for free, it can save you $1,200. <laughs> Hopefully this does not happen to you guys when you do tame your White Arabian horse. As I was bringing it back to put my other saddle on it from the other horse, I was attacked by two wolves spooking my horse and I had to fend them off. I decided to name my new white arabian horse snow because i thought it was appropriate so you guys should let me know in the comment section down below what you guys named your horses so that concludes on how to achieve the white arabian horse for free and save a ton of money and not have to get so far in the story all you have to do is go to lake isabella area and find your arabian horse and you have the second best horse in the game completely free there is no way to get the best horse for free in the game unfortunately i have have tried to do a lot of different research on it you have to buy it and you can only get it towards the very end of the game and that is the rose gray bay horse arabian horse so if you guys are enjoying these videos from me then don't forget to like comment and subscribe down below it would help me out a lot and is greatly appreciated also don't forget to go over to my website gamercory.com if you guys want to get registered for my future giveaways and once i do hit 10,000 subscribers and every 10,000 subscribers after that i do plan on giving away some form of something but anyway until next time youtube you guys keep doing what you're doing because you're already doing it and you guys stay gaming Let's <laughs> go.